Hello guys, as you may know, OpenAI has released the O3 Mini model recently, which is its cheap and best new reasoning model. In this video, we will test its coding capabilities against Claude 3.5 Sonnet, which is one of the best coding models. We will do an interesting website creation and a unique snake game test later in this video. So let's start. Phase 1, this is the coding test results sheet, O3 Mini vs Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Rules. This is an expert-level Python coding test between the O3 Mini and Claude 3.5 Sonnet. We will evaluate the coding proficiency of O3 Mini and the 3.5 Sonnet by asking three expert-level questions. We will give one point per level pass to each AI chatbot. We will give one opportunity per AI to fix a bug if encountered. We will share scores and detailed feedback. So, let's start. Tag let's select expert-level Python questions here. Eat a bit Python challenges. Let's try this question. Copy the question and paste it into Claude 3.5 Sonnet first. Wait now, it is generating an answer. Here is the answer. Let's check it. Let's remove this example code first. Checking. It is getting an error. Let's copy the error to Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Wait. Code is fixed. Let's check it. It's a pass. One point to Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Now, let's present the same question to the O3 Mini. As you can see, it is the O3 Mini model via API in poe.com. Wait. Let it write an answer. Let's check it. It's a pass. 1.203 mini. Let's try the second question. Copy the question and paste it into Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Wait now. Here is the answer. Let's check it. It is now a pass. So, one point to Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Now, let's try the same question with O3 Mini. Let it write an answer. Answer is generated. Let's check it. It is a pass. So, 1.203 mini as well. Try the third question. Copy the question and paste it into Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Let it write an answer. Let's check it. It's a pass. So, one point to 3.5 Sonnet as well. 
Copy the question and paste it into O3 Mini. Wait for the answer. Answer is generated. Let's check it. It's a pass. 1.203 mini. So, these are the final scores, with both models having a tie. Although O3 Mini performed better, especially in the first test, by giving the correct answer in one go. Phase 2, let's move to the second phase, which is the website creation test. Here is the prompt we will use. We are asking it to create an AI art generator website named Stable Arts. It should use a Hugging Face API with the Open Journey model. This API is working. We have the API key also. In the API, if you see, it has a log hello world. That, if the AI is smart, it should remove, as it is not needed. Let's see if both models do that. Lastly, we need an HTML file with all the code, including HTML, JavaScript, and CSS. Let's start with Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Giving the same prompt. Waiting now. The code is generated. Let's try it with the correct API. Let's run it. Testing it now with a simple cat in space image prompt. It worked, so Plod 3.5 Sonnet passed the test easily. Next is O3 Mini. Giving the same prompt. Waiting now. The code is generated. Let's try it with the correct API. Let's run it. Testing it now with a simple image prompt. It is not working. Let's try Claude's code again to see if the API is working or not. It worked in Claude's code. So, O3 Mini made a mistake. Moreover, O3 Mini also didn't delete the log that we didn't need in the code, whereas Claude did delete the hello world. Log. So, O3 Mini failed this test. The final phase, the snake game test with creativity. Let's start with Claude 3.5 Sonnet. I am writing a prompt for a unique, complete snake game. I need creativity in the game. Let's wait. Here is the code. Now, let's try it. It has errors. Asking for a fix. Using the fixed code now.
Now, I am able to play. It is really good. It has unique features like different colored foods, and I think some special foods speed up like power-ups. Also, there is an advanced mode. It has barriers. Interesting game. It has a little bug, as you see, the advanced mode text is not visible completely. But still playable and nice. It also creates a high score file as well. Let's try OpenAIO3 mini model. Asking with the same prompt. Waiting now. Here is the code. Trying. It is working. Looks good. Has proper barriers. And proper foods. It is working well, with a good restart menu and all. But still less creative than Claude 3.5 Sonnet. However, Claude gave us an error at first, meanwhile, O3 Mini gave me a completely working code in the first try without any bugs, I think. So, it is a tie. Final scores. With Claude 3.5 Sonnet beating O3 Mini in the website creation test, it performed better and emerged as the winner of this coding test. Let's move to the conclusion then. In conclusion, as you see, O3 Mini also has some flaws, it is not perfect in coding. Claude 3.5 also has some flaws in coding but is better in web UI creation than O3 Mini, no doubts about it. If we consider their prices and their performance, O3 Mini is much cheaper, so if you need a good coding model while keeping costs affordable, you can choose O3 Mini also. That's all. Thanks for watching.